Hi guys, it's Tasha. It's been frustrating trying to film this video. I've been trying to do it for, it's been, I think, a week or two. And I have failed at it. And one of the reasons why is because I have a new camera. My camera died. This is my old camera. Nothing fancy. It's cam um, Sony Cybershot. And I did love it. And I replaced it with another Sony Cybershot. Nothing fancy again. On the picture is black, but mine is red. And I also bought another tripod. This is the way the, my new tripod looks here. And this is my old tripod. I think I paid 99 cent for it from eBay. I got these things. Y'all know how I love these. I picked up a case of these from the Dollar Tree. And my case that I keep my Foho Bonichi in, I broke the zipper. So I bought another one. And this is just another makeup bag from Target. It was on clearance. So... It should be okay. I hope it does anyway. I hope it will be anyway. And the only makeup item that I purchased, and you guys know I've been on a self-imposed no makeup buy, was a eyeshadow from Rockin' Republic. And not that this eyeshadow is anything spectacular. I just love, love Rockin' Republic's packaging. And here it is. And the eyeshadow is called Adrenaline, which is... To me, just a rusty color. I think NYX's rust may be close to this color. So it's nothing spectacular. But like I said, I love the packaging. So that's the reason why I got that. And I actually want to get a face powder from them as well. So I'll work on that one eventually. I think that's all of the quote-unquote makeup items. Or, well... That was the non-makeup stuff first and then the one makeup item and now the rest of the stuff is nail related. <clears throat> Excuse me. I got this clear nail polish rack and the majority of these polishes are, I must say about half and half, half are new and half are, half are old. But I'm going to start with these few that's on the table first. I got a clear coat from Clean Colors. I got the calcium from Clean Colors, which is what I have on my nails and then, of course you can't see it because it's clear and it actually does make your nails hard. I got this pink, it's called Soft Pink from Kiss, which is what I used for my ribbon, my breast cancer ribbon when I did my breast cancer nails. This gray from NYX is what I used when I did a fall nail look. And push this over to the side and these polishes are some of my favorites let me start up top this one is OPI's Big Apple Red which is my absolute favorite red of all time that's it and that is the most expensive one I have the rest of the polishes are I have two that are like $6.99 or $7.99 and which is the Sally Hansen ones down here which is rupee red and evergreen and the rest are either $1.99 or 99 cent from the from the finished the dollar store from the beauty supply store and where else CVS because that's where the spoiled polishes are from and I have these two right here these two came from Target this is cypress green I think and lovely lilac those are two new colors. This one from Nana Coco, which came from the Beauty Supply Store, is called Ice Prince. This spoiled color here. Oh, what is this? I can never remember this one. I have no reception. Okay. This one is Into the Future. This is a really chunky, great silver glitter polish from Ruby Kisses. This one also, which is a gold from Ruby Kiss, is called Where's the Party. This striper here is Black Pearl, which came from Kiss and the Beauty Supply Store. These two white spoiled polishes. Let me see if it has a name on it. Correction tape. This pink here, 
from Spoil. I think it's called Lovely Lady or something like that. I don't even want to take your time to look. This black from Spoil as well, you see, has been well loved. This pink was the perfect pink for me I, when I did my breast cancer nails. This is called Vanilla Cupcake. This blue right here is called Beach Blue. These are from the dollars from um, the Beauty Supply Store, which were 99 cents each. Clean colors has really stepped up their game. These last five here, which are new, are from the Beauty Supply Store. This blue with the sparkle here is called Mediterranean Night Sky. This purple here is called bold and the beautiful I'm gonna use use these two to do the galaxy nails and I have my lovely Mickey Mouse me which is a neutral orange you jealous and this is my favorite pink it's called Caribbean Island just beautiful I love that color these things right here I got from Sally's and if you bought this thing which is mango mend you got the cuticle softener free and I also bought the nail the I'm sorry the cuticle oil I used California mango back when I first started doing nails professionally years and years and years ago and I still have quite a few of their things even their educational DVD I still have it around the house somewhere a few other things I got from sale just these two blocks where are you guys? Here you go. I got these two blocks because my nails do have ridges. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I got these two as well. And these are some things that I got from online, either eBay or and or Amazon. And I got this brush set. And it brush set is nothing what I was hoping it was gonna be. So I don't even know why. It's it's pretty. That's all I can say. I bought these. These are some dotting tools. And I actually bought a set of three of these. Two for my granddaughters and one for me. And it's nothing like the dotting tools that I already own. And I'll, I'll, if, if there's enough time at the end of this video, I will show them too. I got this nail wheel. And this came from Amazon. And it's like $2 and some change, I think. But I got three of these. And this, I think it's 20 wheels, or is it 10 wheels? I think it's 10 wheels with 20 nails on each wheel. And I got these. This is a mixture of the clay pieces, and oh, which are, some of these are fruit, and some flat back pearls, and I think some bowls in here, some flowers. Anything else? I'm, I'm sure there's a lot of other little things in here. I think some stars as well. That's a star or a starfish. But it, and I like this. This is, this is really nice. It's like a, a gumbo or a soup. There you go. A nail art soup wheel. That's what I call it. I got two of these. And these are the different sizes and different shapes of clear nail rhinestones here's one the colored rhinestones and this is another one look at that two of these then the colored rhinestones I got these flat back pearls and they go from the largest size here all the way to the smaller size over here and see the last thing on this video is these nail stamping plates and I'm waiting on the stamper itself to come in the mail it should be here next week but I'm gonna show you these I said this is QA1 I got these from eBay and I got that really for Halloween I got this one for Christmas it's QA31 no this was oh, QA1 and this one is QA31 which is a Christmas themed plate this is QA25 which looks like it has I don't even know what to say um, Chanel I think that's like Firebird or Thunderbird Dior that the Breast Cancer Ribbon Louis Vuitton Apple Playboy yeah let's see this next one is 
QA60 and the main reason I got this one was because of the emblem here Starbucks emblem this is QA5 which is lips this one is QA21 prints zebra print for sure and other ones this one is QA8 Hello Kitty and this one will probably go to the the, um, the granddaughters because I'm I ordered each one of them their own stamper as well and this one the Halloween themed one this one is QA 47 okay guys I think that's it for my stuff I have one more video to do and it would be for my oldest granddaughter her nail kit as well all right thanks guys bye bye. Sit, sit,